Hello, my name is Walter Unglob, and this is how to convert 294 kilograms to cubic meters. So the first thing to take note of is that these are two completely different types of units. Kilograms is a unit for mass, and cubic meters is a volume unit. However, we can, in a sense, convert between the two if we have a conversion factor. In this case, such a conversion factor relates both the mass and the volume, and so it would be a density. In three dimensions, we typically use uh, the letter, the Greek letter rho, to denote such a density. And rho is defined as the mass of your substance divided by the volume in which it inhabits. So, if we know what the density is, and we know either the mass or the volume, then we can determine either the volume or the mass, the missing piece of information. So, if we have a mass of 294 kilograms, and we're given a density, rho, equal to one kilogram per meters cubed, then we can determine uh, what the volume is, and that would be in units of meters cubed. So, going off of this expression, I multiply both sides by the volume, and I end up with, and divide by the density, I end up with the mass divided by the density. So, in this case, I have 294 kilograms, and I divide by one kilogram per meters cubed. The units of kilograms cancels out, and I'm left with a volume equal to 294 meters cubed, which is the same number as the mass I started with, because the density was just one. So, in general, you would want to use this equation whenever you want to uh, quote-unquote convert from one type of unit to another. You need some conversion factor that cancels out your initial unit and yields the new unit of interest. My name is Walter Unglob, and this is How to Convert 294 Kilograms to Cubic Meters. Mm -hmm.